Hello friends and welcome back to another Game Maker video. In our last video we worked on creating a house. Now we're going to work on creating an event where we can sleep in our bed. And then we'll probably do an end if I have enough time. I have to decide how long I want this video to be. Alright, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to left click on the hometown, which is under Heart World. Then you're going to go inside of your house. Wait, where's your house? There's your house. Okay. Hometown. Just going to left click on the house. Now we're going to go and we're going to create an, a bed event so that you can actually go to sleep. So you're going to right click and you're going to left click on the event over here. It's next to the map and the pencil. And you guys should be able to see like it highlighted now. Because I think I highlighted, I found a way to make it work. So it's working now. Okay, you're going to right click on the top part of your bed and you're going to press new. We're going to call this event sleep. So this is going to be a sleep event, okay? So you can go to sleep. All right, for the first one, left click on it. Left click again. Actually, no. Show choices. Left click on show choices. The first one is going to say, go to sleep. Two will be stay awake. Stay awake. Let's let's cap on. No, we don't need to. It's okay. All right. Now, on here it says show choices. Go to sleep. Stay awake. Go to sleep. You're gonna right click on that event. You're gonna press new. When you go to sleep, you're gonna go to number two over here. You're gonna go over to where it says timing. Screen, fade out screen, okay? It's gonna fade out. You're gonna right click underneath this blue line that says fade out screen. You're gonna left click on this. You're gonna go to where it says timing. You're gonna click wait. And then you're gonna press okay. Then you're gonna left click on it, I mean right click on the blue line underneath the wait. You're going to press new. You're going to go to one. You're going to click on show text. And it's going to say you, you're going to type in you rest until morning. Left click on the face twice. This will come up. Click this guy because this is your guy right here. Press OK. Now go to the bottom over here where the window is. It says background and window position. For window, left click on it. We're going to make this dim. We're going to put it at the top. And we're going to preview it to make sure it works. You rest until morning. Very good. Close. And you're going to press OK. All right. Next thing we're going to do, you're going to right click on it. You're going to left click. You're going to click on two for your page. You're going to go over to timing. You're going to press wait. You're going to press OK. The reason why we got to wait is because if you don't make it wait, it'll make all this happen in one, one swoop. And it's not realistic in any way. All right. Then you're going to right click on it again. You're going to press new. You're going to go over to where it says transfer player. You're going to left click on that. It's going to already have your destination for your house. But what you're going to do is you're going to left click on it. You're going to put your position right here or here or wherever you want. I would like to put him right beside the bed. Okay. You're going to put him there. You're going to press OK. Buttons at the bottom. Can't see it because my face is in the way. And oh, and at the bottom right here, where it says direction and fade, we want to have him facing left. That way it looks like he's facing his bed. Okay. And then, right after we transfer him, we're going to right click on this again. New. Do you know what comes next? Wait. 60 frames. Okay. And then... 
you're going to right click on it again you're going to press new we're almost done i promise go to where it says screen fade in all right now when it says when stay awake it says stay awake left click on this little diamond here right click on it left for new go back to one show text I'll rest when I'm dead. I'll rest when I'm dead. He'll say that. We'll show his face again, too. Go to actor one. That's where his face is. It's right underneath this guy at the top. He was the one we started out with, but I wanted this guy. And you're going to press OK. And then we're going to make this at the top. So background, I mean, window, we're going to make this dim. For bottom, you're going to switch it to top. We're gonna press okay, we don't need to preview it. And then you're gonna press okay. All right, now that the event was made, you're gonna press save. And we're gonna play. Now, if I'm right, my in the last, um, in the other engine I used, you couldn't just Go to the event, the bed. You have to add something to the bed. And this one, if they haven't fixed the glitch in it by now, I don't know that this engine is going to be worth buying for me. Like, I really don't. I bet I have to probably add something. Let's see if we can go to bed. We have to press the action button, and it isn't working. See? I knew it. Once you click out of the game, it's automatically going to take you right back to your event, which is right over here. Right click on it. Left click edit. Go over to where it says image. Left click on it twice. We're going to go down. All right, so now we have to choose something we think we can use for him to to act as like a trigger check the switches um switch fs switch one two no that doesn't look right does it it really doesn't go to tile set b left click on it doesn't seem to be anything there let's go to tile set c can't find anything there go to where door two is press flame i'm so sorry this happened guys i'm so sorry you have to do this all right, so the the third one down of this little green, this green one next to this purple blue one, the third one down, click on that one, left click on it, and then you're going to press OK. And then you're going to press OK again. And then now we're going to go up, we're going to save our game again. You guys should probably have this down packed by now. All right. And now, press play. It's going to start, start us off from Heart World. Or, I mean, Heart. Yeah, Heart World. All right, so let's try it out. Here we go. We're going home. <laughs> you guys like that song? No? Singing is not good, is it? All right. All right, it's time for bed, mister. When you be able to sleep, press enter. Go to sleep. Oh, it worked. Okay. You rest until morning. All right, good. I'll rest when I'm dead. Very good. See, it works, guys. Um, so now, now that we've done that, we basically got the whole basis for our game. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to come back to our map. Left click on your map. It's next to the event and next to the, the pencil over here. You guys probably know that if you've seen this game already. All right, so we're going to create another map, guys. 
Let's go back to Heart World first. Okay, right click on Heart Kingdoms, left click New, and we are going to make a map. It's going to be called In, and it's going to be Inside. Okay. We're going to make our, the end, we're going to give it like a little kitchen look. So, hmm, I don't like the cracked floor. The heck happened at this place? Something bad must have happened. All right, so we're going to go over to the flood tool. Left click on it. Click it to put your floor down. Go back to your pencil. Left click your pencil. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to build our little wall. So our wall is going to. Who likes this kind of wall? It looks kind of weird, doesn't it, guys? Doesn't matter. All right, you're gonna make your wall. You're gonna make your wall long enough. We talked about that in the previous video. We're gonna build our little, our little top part for this. I'm not sure what I want it to look like. Cause it just looks so weird. We'll do this top part like this. When we get like this, it's just odd color. It's just a really odd. Don't really like that. I don't really like this either. But we're gonna stick with it, guys, because this video's for you, it's not for me. Video's for you, not for me. All right. Let me create like this little. Put like these little tables over here. Um, all right, guys, go to tile B. All right, we're going to scroll down. Let's see, we're going to scroll down. We're going to treat it like it's a little pub. We're going to put like a piano. That was their entertainment. You know, they have like a piano over here. And then you're going to go over, you're going to Basically get like the whole kitchen. I only get the, ch the kitchen stuff, like, like the kitchen stuff. And then you so put that stuff like into the wall. And then we want to get like a counter. You want to make our counter surround like the wall area. So let's look for it together. Cause I don't know where it is in this engine. I still wasn't able to actually find it like um, I went through here and I tried to look for it and I couldn't find it. Guys, is it an A? Whatever. So, we'll make like a counter over here and then we'll have a guy and he'll like walk out and he'll like walk around. And then um, we'll create like a little room where you can go to sleep too. The room will be like over here. So, let me... Let's see this design. Sorry guys. This one over here next to this, underneath this red rug, there's this little weird looking square. Yeah, that's the thing. Grab that. And then you're gonna bring it over. There we go. We'll make this like the little room. We'll um we'll make this a little room. We'll we'll add like a table in here. And we'll add like See what else let's go to see we can put like um some bed covers in here in the corner <laughs> uh, i don't know that we want to actually put a bed i mean the table takes up all the room what the heck all right anyway so this isn't a very good example of a room oh uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back and we're gonna i'm gonna go back to a and I'm going to basically just make this to be just the entrance. And I'm going to just basically use, I basically just put the towel over this table. Instead, we're going to put a bed there. So scroll up. Oh, let's see, B. I think that whenever we scroll up, it should just stay there, right? Since this is a hotel, the bed is supposed to be a little bit better. But it's not fancy. So we're not going to use a fancy bed. We're going to use this one. And then we're going to add a door and we're going to lock the door. 
you'll only be able to get in is if you get a key from the guy who's selling the stuff in the merchandise. But you can also buy other stuff from him like food. Let's decorate the tables, guys. Just have a little fun with this. You don't need to follow me on this part if you don't want. I'm just going to like add some things. Um, let's pretend that they're eating. Uh, we can add chairs. Go back to A to add chairs. I think, a, I think chairs are in A, aren't they? Nope, some B. Shows how much I know about this engine. Nothing. All right. Let me just add these chairs. And add a chair here. Let me add one here. Here. All right. So there's going to be. All right, so this is a, a pub. Put like this, this, I'll put this whole bar like right here. Put the whole thing right here on the wall. There we go. And then I'm just going to put a random guy. You'll have him just walk around. All right, next thing you're going to do is you're going to go back to your events tab, which is up here. Left click on it. Right click anywhere you want on the screen. Put him right here. Um, new. And we're going to call this in. <laughs> oh my gosh, we're going to call the event in too. Let's call the event. Um, uh, uh, the event will be called like um, rent. Something like that. All right, so you're going to right click. You're going to press new. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to do show text first. How may I be of service? How may I be of service? Um, so any other engine, I know that you can add your name. Who do we want to work here? We want it to be somebody that looks nice. They look like they're out fighting battles everywhere. Who looks like they're just hanging out? Nobody looks like they really just hang out. She looked like she could run a bar. We'll use her. She's actor three. And she's the second. She's in the actor three category. So we're gonna press okay. So she asked, how can I how can I be of service? We're gonna put this in the middle and we're gonna make the dim. We're gonna and then we're gonna press okay. All right, how may I be of service? All right, you're gonna say, you're gonna show choices. First choice is gonna be rent. No, first choice is gonna be buy, buy food. The second one will be rent a oh, rent a room. Doesn't need to be capitalized. I'm just doing that. And this will be like at the top. Wait, did it say top position? Position right, middle, left. If it's on the right, it's going to be on this side. Let's make it on the left. And then you're going to press OK. All right. This is all you need to do, guys, right here. OK. This is easy. When buy food, you're going to right click. You're going to press new. You're going to go to. Three. Shop processing right here. Left click on it. Right click on that. Edit. You're going to come over here. And you're going to put whatever you want to sell. Magic water. I'm going to specify the price. 300. That's fine. Edit. There's actually no food in here. Oh my god. The video will be too long if I do food. We're going to make our own food, guys. I'm going to show you how in the next video. Okay, guys? This is just an example. Just we'll sell two things since we can only since there's no food. I hope I didn't disappoint you guys. When rent a room. 
Sorry, I'm going too fast. All right, so this is what will happen. If you press, your uh, your first choice will be um, when you buy, your first, your first, blah. You can buy food, guys, which is not really food. You can buy this, okay? Read the room. Right click on it. Press new. All right. The next thing you got to do, guys, is you guys are going to need to grab an item from her. She's going to have an item, okay? So, select item. The key item is going to be, left click, it can be any item. It can be any of these. Two, three, four, okay. Item three, key item. Hit in item A, or this is what you guys do. And then you press OK. All right, hit it item A. All right, and then, so now, but we're not gonna, you know what? Sorry guys, that's so terrible at this. Right click on that and delete it. Delete, because that's really difficult for me to explain to you guys. The way that I'm showing you to do it is how I do it when I when I go into my database and I actually like, like I said, variables, variable 001003, those are the items you can create yourself. So I can say like, I'm gonna sell like a loaf of bread. I can put loaf of bread there and that will be like variable one because it'll be saved in the database. So it'll be in the system. What we're gonna do is we're trying to just rent a room. So click new. What we're gonna do is we're gonna change items and we're gonna make an increase of, uh, we're gonna say when you have, when you have a stimulant or whatever, you're going to increase it. It's going to press OK. Rent a room. And then um, rent a room. And then she's going to give you that. And then you're going to say, thank you so much for your service. So go back to where it says message, show text, left click on it. You're going to say, thank you so much. OK. And our guy is going to look so grateful. He has that grateful look on his face. Look at it. It's so great. All right. And then it's going to be them. We're going to have it at the top. It's going to press OK. Thank you so much. It's going to end. OK. And we want this person to be walking around. She's actor three. So don't forget to, to select image. All right. Actor three. Remember the lady we saw walking around? This looks like her, right? Left click on her, press OK. Then you're gonna press OK again. And then now, and I might have to end this video because it might be too long, guys. Now um, you're gonna save it, go next to the scissors. This is open. We're gonna save it, press play. All right, guys, we're going to test this out. And if it works, I'm going to end the video here. And in my next video, I'm going to pick up with the room and key. And then I'll go into the database stuff for you guys. I just didn't realize the video was going to take as long as it did. It took such a long time, longer than I wanted. Um, all right, so there's something else we forgot to do. And I realized that when I started the game. We need to make one of these areas the end so that we can actually walk into it. Because right now we don't have one. So we're going to go back to our map. All right. We're going to go back to our hometown over here. Left click on hometown. All right. And then we're going to go up to where events are again. Left click on event. Okay. Which one should we make the end? It should be next to our house. No, we'll put it over here. That makes sense. We'll do a quick creation event this time. We'll do a transfer. So from here, our own town, we're gonna left click on it. And we are gonna make it so that you go into the end. And you are gonna just pop up here. Okay, guys. Um <laughs> I'm gonna press OK. Alright. And I'm gonna press OK. And then now uh, when we press enter, we're just going to walk in that place. There's, this event doesn't even have a name. Let's edit it. Up here, you see in the events right here, I need house. Right click on it. Edit it. And call it 
um, pub. Basically, it's like a pub or whatever. So you transfer the player to the end. Yeah, transfer the player to end. Okay, and then we're gonna go over here to where this image is. We're gonna make the image a door. So scroll down. I'm trying to go fast. Sorry, guys. I realize the video is is this video is actually taking a lot longer than I want it. I really want to just show you guys really fast and have that be it, but I don't. It just didn't work out. Press OK for that door. It's gonna have the door animation. Uh, it's gonna we're gonna do player touch, and we're gonna press OK. We're gonna test this out. We're gonna see if it works, and then in my next video. Um, we'll work on creating our own items in the database. We can make food and stuff. Okay, so save that. Now I'll go over to play. Sorry, guys. I just rambled through this whole video. I just wanted you guys, I just want to teach you guys really fast. And I don't want you to get overwhelmed. And I feel like I put a lot of information in there. Just about everything, like the pub, transferring to and from. I think you guys should have it by now, though. It even has a door animation. Did you hear it? My regular animations don't have that. Press enter. How may I be of service? You can buy food. Buy. Oh, you don't have nothing. You can't buy anything. That's too bad. All right, now, so press enter again. How may I be of service? Rent a room. Thanks so much. And I should have a stimulant. So how do I check to see if I have? Okay, so let's see the item that he has. Item. Yes, see? Key item. Okay. Not key item. Key item. All right. Armor. Item. Item. It's okay. You guys saw that he had a stimulant, right? You have to you have to right click, guys, in order to pause it, the video. Then you left click on it. You see, there's a stimulant there. You have it. So that's actually the item you need in order to get into that door. So when we come back to my video next time. We're gonna make a door here. He's gonna be able to walk through the door. I'm already getting kind of irritated with this game. You can probably tell. So I'm just going to end the video here, and then I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like it, give me a thumbs up, right?